The Palisades nuclear power plant now has a clear path to restarting thanks to a $1.5 billion loan backed by both the Biden and Trump administrations. This makes it the first publicly announced loan guarantee under the Trump administration. The plant, which originally shut down in 2022, is expected to start producing electricity again by the end of 2025. Holtec International, the company that owns the plant, has already received two payments from the loan to help with inspections, repairs, and upgrades. Once restarted, the 800-megawatt reactor could continue operating until at least 2051, supplying reliable energy to the grid. The Trump administration's decision to move forward with the loan is significant because it had paused many federal financial programs for review. However, it made an exception for Palisades, recognizing the importance of nuclear energy for America's energy security and economic benefits. The project is expected to support or retain up to 600 jobs, many of which will be filled by experienced workers who previously worked at the plant. Holtec also has other big plans for the Palisades site. The company is preparing to build two SMR300s on the same site. These will be their in-house design of a 300 megawatt pressurized water reactor. If successful, this project will be a major step towards expanding advanced nuclear technology in the United States. If everything goes as planned, Palisades will become the first U.S. nuclear power plant to be restarted after being shut down. Ultimately, Palisades revival marks not just a plant restart, but an important turning point for nuclear power in the United States.